Hey guys, welcome back to the unboxing Tito. 5G connectivity is the biggest tech trend last 2020. And again, 2021, it just got more affordable. And for only 10,790 pesos, I got my Redmi Note 90 5G. My channel provides unboxing and reviews of all the hottest phones available today. So if you're new here, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon para ma-notify ka each time mag-upload ako ng bagong video. So after all that, let's proceed with the unboxing video. Finally, we have here the Redmi Note 90. And sa harap ng box, nandiyan yung picture ng device, pati yung back panel niya with the corresponding color. Sa bottom, nakalagay din dyan na this is a 5G capable device. And on both sides, may nakasulat Redmi Note 90 with easy access to the Google apps you use most. And by that, we know na naka-global ROM yung unit na na-receive natin. At the bottom, nakasulat dyan yung color ng unit natin which is the Daybreak Purple. Also, nakasulat din dyan yung memory configuration natin which is 4 gigs of RAM and 64 gigs of internal storage. Okay, so open natin siya. When you open this, yung una mong makikita is this white paper box. And at the center, may nakasulat designed by Redmi. Okay, so open natin siya. Sa likod, makikita natin dyan yung SIM ejector pin. Sa loob ng paper box, you will find some paperwork which is the user guide and warranty card. Meron din siyang free na jelly case na may circular opening for the camera. Next, you'll find is the phone itself, the Redmi Note 90. And nakasulat sa harap yung mga key features niya. So, this device is powered by the MediaTek Dimensity 800U with dual 5G connectivity. Meron din siyang 48MP high resolution camera and 13MP yung selfie camera niya sa harap. Yung screen niya is 6.53 Full HD Plus dot display na may dual speakers. And yung battery niya is 5,000 mAh capacity na may 18W fast charging capability. Let's set this aside for now and check natin yung contents pa ng box. At the bottom, we have this white Type-C charging cable. Also included is this white 22W fast charging brick although yung unit natin is capable lang of 18W fast charging. So now yung favorite part natin, tanggalin natin siya sa plastic. Okay. Yung color natin is what they call the daybreak purple. Meron ka pang isang option which is the nightfall black. Yung front panel niya is already Gorilla Glass 5. Which is an advantage sa kapatid niya na sa Redmi 90 kasi Gorilla Glass 3 lang yun. But yung back panel niya is made up of plastic. Pero okay lang naman kasi matte yung finish niya kaya hindi siya fingerprint magnet. Textured din yung likod niya kaya hindi siya madulas sa kamay. Yung back camera design niya is similar kay Poco X3. Meron siyang triple camera setup with a 48 MP main camera and an LED flash. Kaya din niya mag shoot ng 4K videos at 30 FPS. To give you an idea ng camera capability ni Redmi Note 90, here are some photo samples. So this is our first look sa front panel natin. We have here a 6.53 IPS LCD panel. Meron siyang Full HD Plus screen resolution kaya okay na rin yung display quality. So ipakita ko sa inyo quickly yung mga apps installed the first time you boot up the device. So meron ka agad na pre-installed na Google Play Store and the Google Assistant. Sa bottom left, meron din dyang folder for Google services which includes Gmail, YouTube, and YouTube Music. Sa next page, there are some other pre-installed apps. You could uninstall na lang yung mga hindi magusto. And para sa mga mahilig mag-stream ng movies, meron na rin Netflix pre-installed. For its chipset, this has MediaTek Dimensity 800U with dual 5G connectivity, making this the cheapest 5G capable device sa market. So para sa mga nagtatanong, I ordered this sa Lazada last January 17. And sulit naman yung ipinaghintay ko ng 2 weeks kasi I got this for the very low price of 10,790 pesos. A quick look sa graphic settings for Mobile Legends, wala tayong HFR mode na available for this phone. And dahil bago pa lang siyang device, wala pa siyang available na settings for Ultra, kaya high pa lang yung gagamitin natin. To give you a quick teaser, I have here two Dimensity 800U phones. On my left is the Realme V15 with a 6.4 Super AMOLED display and on my right is the Redmi Note 90 with a 6.53 IPS LCD panel. Stay tuned to my channel because I will be having an in-depth comparison video between these two phones right here. For its software, the Redmi Note 90 is running Android 10 with MIUI 12 skin on top. 
So here are my first impressions of the Redmi Note 90. Yung biggest selling point niya for me is sa halagang 10,790 pesos. Meron ka ng 5G capable device. Sulit na yan especially if you're on a budget. Pero gusto mo future proof pa rin yung phone mo. For me, sakto lang naman yung screen resolution niya at 1080p for this price point. And gusto ko yung trend ngayon ng mga phone companies na kahit plastic yung back panel niya, matte siya to avoid fingerprints and textured din para may better grip ka. So this is just a quick unboxing and first impressions video of this phone. Stay tuned sa channel natin for our unboxing and full review of the Redmi Note 90. If you have questions and suggestions for our next video, hit me up in the comments down below and I'll make sure to reply. So that's the end of our video and I hope nagustuhan nyo. Thumbs is a plus, subs is a must. I'm the unboxing Tito and I will see you next time.